If we Republicans choose Donald Trump as our nominee, the prospects for a safe and prosperous future are greatly diminished. If Donald Trump's plans were ever implemented, the country would sink into prolonged recession. Isn't he a huge business success? Doesn't he know what he's talking about? No, he isn't. And no, he doesn't. <laughs> a business genius, he is not. Mr. Trump's bombast is already alarming our allies. Let ISIS take out Assad, he said, and then we can pick up the remnants. This recklessness is recklessness in the extreme. Now, Donald Trump tells us that he is very, very smart. <laughs> I'm afraid that when it comes to foreign policy, he is very, very not smart. <laughs> Donald Trump lacks the temperament to be president. After all, this is an individual who mocked a disabled reporter. Donald Trump says he admires Vladimir Putin. At the same time, he's called George W. Bush a liar. That is a twisted example of evil trumping good. There's a dark irony in his boasts of his sexual exploits during the Vietnam War, while at the same time, John McCain, whom he has mocked, was imprisoned and tortured. Dishonesty is Donald Trump's hallmark. His imagination must not be married to real power. Think of Donald Trump's personal qualities, the bullying, the greed, the showing off, the misogyny, the absurd third grade theatrics. Now, Mr. Trump relishes any poll that reflects what he thinks of himself. But polls are also saying that he will lose to Hillary Clinton. Of course, a Trump nomination enables her victory. There's plenty of evidence that Mr. Trump is a con man, a fake. Mr. Trump has changed his positions, not just over the years, but over the course of the campaign and on the Ku Klux Klan daily for three days in a row. I predict that there are more bombshells in his tax returns. I predict that he told the New York Times that his immigration talk is just that, talk. He has too much to hide. Mr. Trump is directing our anger for less than noble purposes. He creates scapegoats of Muslims and Mexican immigrants. This is the very brand of anger that has led other nations into the abyss. Donald Trump is a phony, a fraud. His promises are as worthless as a degree from Trump University. <laughs> this is a time for choosing. He has neither the temperament nor the judgment to be president. His personal qualities would mean that America would cease to be a shining city on a hill.